about business with her. Do I have a business with her? I just deleted the account with 250,000 naira now. Hey homie, welcome back to my channel. How you doing? What's happening? My name is Omi Odike and this is Talk to Your Homie TV, my darling. Hey, I love to give very sweet and juicy gifts and today we're talking baby Niger lockdown. The things happening outside the house is now mad. Every cast management, they are dragging this guy called CMC, eh? Well, CMC is this American, like, not, he's not American, he's Nigerian, but he lives in America. He sells cars and while Erica was in the house, he was making a lot of promises about how he's going to get her a car. In fact, he even brought the picture of the car. It's a Mercedes car, white, brand new Mercedes car. You get me? You give Erica, you give her two million naira. He had all these plans and promises, right? And then Erica has come back or oh, been disqualified like how many weeks ago and then I'm well, looking like, okay, brother Lila, like, where's the car? Where's the, get me? Now, yesterday, what happened was to the guy called Tricky T and on live, he sent Tricky T after like doing live video call here yeah, on Instagram, he sent Tricky T 250,000 naira and Erica's man, well, let's say Erica's management, one man shall comes online to come and trash CMC. Now, the thing about bloggers, some bloggers, I will not lie, is that a lot of us like to hear the juicy thing so the video circulating around town you get me is the video of the guy that cmc man insulting erica like who is erica is she a bastard you get me he's really angry that who is that guy to come and drag him for not giving erica money like what's that you know so people are looking like ah it's audio money it's clinical but omi or Dicky had to go and dig deep and see what really happened you and i will watch all the videos yeah because Afterwards, when like it all happened here, yeah, the CMC guy now called one lady in Nigeria, yeah, and they like on Instagram live, yeah, and they discussed it. Now, when they started to discuss it, and I said, okay, this is exactly what happened. So you and I will walk through it together, and we will now form our own decision after watching it here. Yeah. But let me just breeze through what was happening in the house, cause the house, I mean, there's only five of them, and this is the final week. A lot of them, like especially Dorothy, she's always on the bed sleeping, sleeping. Yeah. So in the house, what's been happening so far has just been first of all, yesterday they call they call V and Dorothy, they won their wild task, and it was a million naira to share amongst the three of them. That's one. Then two, okay, this one is interesting. So, um, Leko, so they were all auditioning in the house here yeah, about blood groups and thing. And V said that she's one of the lucky, un unlucky ones. She's AS. So whenever she sees someone that she likes and about to marry and thing, that's not where she now figure out that the guy is AS too. And you know because of blood group now, you just she wants to just marry AA to be sure, sure. And then Leko finally revealed to us that he's S. Now, according because I had to go online to find out what SC meant and how you get me. Now, according to um, Google, SC is a hemoglobin that carries symptoms similar to those of sickle cell disease, but it's milder. Do you understand? So I'm guessing that's, that explains his body type, his shape. That's why he looks that way because he's like SC. And I mean, this just shows that we need to, like, you know, this body, people that body shame people, oh, you're very thin, you're very fat, you're very clinical, you like mob sick, all that thing. I hope this just shows us that we need to calm down. When you, you don't know what anybody's battling here, but that's it so far. Then today they are doing a lifting task. Well, let's let's enter the meat of the matter. Let's begin to watch the videos. So I want to start first of all with the video of Erica's team or the guy talking about the CMC guy not giving Erica the money first. Um, so that's uh, messaging me about Erica receiving two million on the car from CMC. I just want to quickly clear you guys that she hasn't received anything yet, and um, he promised to give Erica two million naira on the car. Now he's changing everything. He said he's going to give Erica five hundred thousand. I shouldn't sign a contract. Then the car will come in, come in next year. Then the remaining one point five million he will balance her later. You know, so that wasn't um, his um, initial statement. So just want to let you know that he she hasn't received anything yet. So Mr. CMC, can you delete the post of your Instagram page so that um, uh, we don't mislead the general public? You know. What the Igbo version of so why I said in Igbo means that Mr. CMC, if you do not mean to give Erica the money, then you should go through the like you should fly off 
through the window let people that have money come in through the door that's an insult we yes, that's an insult so cmc really went gaga like what is this so now we're going to listen to cmc's um live chat with this lady and then we'll understand where it's coming from do you get let's listen Ah, uh, okay. You know, let me try and go on Instagram because see, the, the thing is, a lot of times, yeah, we need to try not to be gullible because now online, the way CMC puts it here, yeah, he puts it like, I am going to give Erica two million naira and a car, right? Now we did not know that there were hidden conditions. You get me behind all these things. We did not know. All we, the public, knew was well, he's going to give Erica two million naira and a car. Do you get? Now, when I hear there's conditions, right? Let's listen. Let's continue listening. Who pays half a million naira for, for, for saying one talk? Do they pay for, for talking? Do you pay for audio? If you want to talk, do you pay for... God, give, give us money to talk for free. Talking is free. If you're a beggar, am I owing her? When I endorse her with, 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 with my money, did I tell her that, 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 that it, it, it's by duress? Should be deep. I think you said people want to receive from me. What kind of nonsense is that? Do you, know why I'm, do you know why I'm pissed? I'm pissed because that that person that posted that shit on my wall knows her and they walk together. Is that it? Is it how she wants to grow her brand? What kind of nonsense is that? I'm pissed with that. But she know me. Please calm down. I don't want you to say things, you know, out of anger. Mm -hmm. I really don't. I really don't. Please. All right, CMC. CMC, let me just break it down for them. Let me break it down for them. Break it down. CMC wanted to endorse a big brother Niger housemate to represent his brand because his weddings are coming up. The best person that he felt was okay to do that was Erica. Her team came here and he pitched the idea to them and they agreed and everything was cool. That week, a total of um, 2 million naira was brought out for voting, for voting for Erica. And we have the receipt, the proof it. Uh, Erica, lucky for her, she was not offering a nomination. That. So Kidwaya came and we used that money on Kidwaya. We had all the, we had all the proof. The, after. So after Erica, because of people and not to endorse but she, but she, because she was disqualified but he decided not to during the day of the incident what CMC said was this he wants to endorse someone to work brand the CMC brand 
And what is going to happen is, once the person comes out of the Big Brother Niger house, the person will come on Instagram live with him, and she, he will credit the person two million naira on Instagram live. That hasn't been done. The car was part of the endorsement deal. The car came in the car. Now, mind you, when we posted the, um, the flyer of the car and Erica, CMC posted it saying that this is what I'm going to give Erica for the endorsement. I posted it as well because I am the liaison and the media partner for this deal. Erica's team did not acknowledge it. They didn't like the post. They acted like over and we understood. Moving forward, in the contract, it was stated that after CMC and Erica come and they make the deal, the one million naira will be given to her um, this the next month. That's this month. Then January, which is after the wedding, because the wedding takes place in December, because she will come to the wedding. That was made part of the endorsement deal. Comes to the wedding, another one million naira will be paid to her. How all her expenses for the wedding will be paid for and accounted for, because it's not just one wedding. We have another one going outside the country, outside Nigeria, some going in Nigeria. So Wait, let's just stop and talk about that. Ah, don't believe everything you hear online, no. Like, I mean, don't believe the totality of everything you hear online, because look at all the conditions that needed to have been met before he gives Erica the money. She has to go for a wedding. There may be like, we're like two weddings, one in Nigeria, one outside Nigeria. All we just saw was a car. In fact, there's a picture. Yeah, I'll, I'll put the picture here now. There's a picture where he, you know, puts Erica's face, be, you know, beside the picture. He was going, beside the car, a picture of the car rather, that he would give it to Erica. That's all we saw. But we do not hear all these intricacies of the get me until Nyash found Nyash open and everybody's hearing it. All I'm trying to say is do not believe everything you hear online, you get me, because it can be misleading. Let's continue listening. So the logistics, the travel plans, everything will be handled by the CMC team. That was the deal. The car will be given to her in December as well, because she has to ship it when mm. Then inside the contract, all Erica's team does this contract thing is just an introduction contract. So you can negotiate. Also, I laying down our terms, right? We told you what the brand is about. We told you what we wanted, and we sent it to you to, to them. In the contract, it stated that not the contract. You can negotiate. This is just an introduction. So it's left for them to come and say, okay, we don't want this. We don't like this clause. Let's okay. adjust this here and there. They didn't do that. They just rejected it. That's what happened. So the two million naira. That was meant to give to give it, that meant that is meant to be given. Now, to look at the cut of the five hundred thousand. What is the five hundred thousand that you mentioned for? The five hundred thousand, like, if this deal is not reached, if this deal she doesn't want it, that five hundred thousand will be given to her, no questions asked. Hmm. Period. That's it. The five hundred thousand will be given and to her the same day. The same day. And again, every single thing that we did with this Erica's team and Erica. Erica has never spoken to CMC, ever. CMC has never heard Erica's voice. He has never spoken to her on the phone. The two million naira that is meant to be given to her on live was meant to take place on Instagram live. They were meant to have a conversation, but that never happened. They completely ghosted CMC as soon as that. And they all followed him. As soon as, before the contract was even sent to Erica's team, they unfollowed CMC. For no reason whatsoever. Wait, 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 wait. If I want to sign a contract with somebody and the person unfollows me before the person signs the contract, why do I go ahead and sign a contract? Do you understand? I mean, because let, let, let's be real, let's be fair. Yeah? I have right now on Instagram, I have like 70, 78,000 followers as I now. And I, I was at my friend's place recently and I realized that 
a friend, a, a friend of mine got married and I didn't even know why because I wasn't following the person. So a lot of times when you have a lot of followers, you might not even know who is following you, following you and who is not. Yeah, but I'm not saying that if this was brought up, if this lady, I'm guessing the lady is like the middle man between the CMC guy and Erica Stein. So if the lady found out that you get me, they unfollowed CMC before the contract was signed. So why did you guys go along? Because it felt like that was already a no. You get me but i mean why would they also unfollow the cmc guy and still come to the house to come and sign the contract it's getting really messy man it's getting really messy i can't lie but let's continue listening and then it, but and mind you this has nothing to do with erica it's her team erica is you know she's not the one that made the deal you know so we understood that we understood that it had nothing to do with erica because at that time she was not the one handling her instagram page it was handled by a lady called Mercy. So we understood that maybe they are, they are trying to get, you know? So with everything that happened, you know, they didn't really care. They didn't want, they didn't appreciate it. They never called CMC. She has, she has never spoken to her, ever. And mm. that is okay. But to stop a relationship built on that is, you know, how the hell would you feel? Mm -hmm. That's what it was. That's what it was. They never acknowledged him. They never acknowledged him. Why, 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 why is that guy? I don't know that guy. Why, why, why is that guy now coming out? Because the same promise was made to Tricky T. I yes. made the same promise to Tricky T. I said, once you come out, I'm going to give you a slot on my wedding. Yes. And I said it to the handler. And he came out and you said, Tricky T is out. Can we do that? And I said, yes, we can do it now. I have my daughter around in my office, but I think I can spend 90 minutes so that we can do it. Tricky T was, was online now. And I told him, if you want to work with me, we can work. If you don't want to work with me, let me go ahead and 50,000 and go. I don't care. Why are they now calling me out since, since how long they didn't come at me? Why is it now? Why is it today that I gave that young man that money? That they are calling me out. I want to know because I made it clear. Take five hundred thousand and go, or come and work with me. I give you two million. I give you a car. What seven million naira? Seven million. Yes. By the way, the deal all together was worth seven million naira. Let's not let's get that straight. The deal, the CMC package deal with Erica was worth seven million naira. That was the whole package. Wait, wait, let's let, let's talk about that. He's he made one sense because I, after after this video, guys, give me a long video, but it's sweet, it's juicy, just here. Yeah. I'll play a video of CMC actually giving Tricky T the money. Obviously, we have to see that, yeah. So I'm guessing to answer him, I'm guessing maybe the guy that is talking all this talk is looking like okay, you gave you gave Tricky T money, and Erica's post is still on your page. Cause it's still there saying that you're going to give her a car and you haven't given her a car so maybe the guy because if the guy did not make all this noise we would never have known all these things happening on the ground here yeah? and i'm sure in our head we'll still be thinking maybe the guy has given erica her money or yeah her money you understand and i mean yeah listen to me now because According to what you're saying, I mean, I don't know, I'm not in your team, I wasn't there, but according to what these people are saying right now, they told Erica to go online. And it's true, this, I, I, I knew this CMC guy based off URL. He likes to do live. At, at some point, he was forming, I mean, I won't say forming, but he was in this whole matchmaking girls up to guys. He had like some contact here and it was live video. URL, he, he and URL even organized a full on online matchmaking thing where you where he was trying to match make you will do you get me that's how i met him do you understand so he does all this matchmaking thing he would dash you money but instagram live is a big deal for him obviously so i'm guessing the guy they give the guy you know asked the question we would not have known and i'm guessing the guy asked the question because he's looking like you're giving a, a tricky team money online so what about erica so why do you have the picture there if you're not going to give erica the money you took it let's continue listening she has never spoken to erica on the phone they never talked. Even when Erica was disqualified, we kept on reaching out to their team. We kept on doing that, doing this and the third, trying to make sure she's okay. It wasn't acknowledged ever. The Instagram post about the car and you know telling us telling her that no matter what happens right here was never acknowledged. That car 
deal was never acknowledged. Is that if, how, is that, because let me tell you something, I want to say this as I sound clear. If you give somebody your handle to handle your handle for you, automatically whatever that goes on there is your fault. Because if you, if you should trust somebody with your house, whatever thing that goes on in your house is your fault because it's your house. Mm -hmm. I did not say anything, I did not mention anything. But why would that guy know what is in the contract that I sent out that is only known by between me, you, and her? Why would that guy say that I fly out the window? Who is sorted this other first? Let me pull up and come through the door. Who is that walking? Pull up, agreed. But that was supposed to happen on Instagram Live. Mm -hmm. It didn't happen. He never called CMC. I said on Instagram Live. Mm -hmm. Wait, chill, wait. Let's 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 just stop here. Yeah? So the car has been shipped. You, you know what I feel? I feel like maybe Erica came out of the house and read the contract, and it did not make. No, no, I won't say it did not make sense to her. Maybe she just felt like she can. She could have been priced higher. Do you understand? As I, I'd feel that might be what she might have thought, or maybe she came out and realized that well, I can be priced higher than that. All I'll just say is that it's too early to be having messiness with contract. It's too early. Let's watch, you know, when CMC gave Chukiti the money as proof that indeed he really gave Chukiti the money. Let, let's just watch it. I'm saying it's, um, it's, it's GTB, right? Yes, it is. GTB. Okay. Come here, I remember. Zero, zero, three, nine. Zero zero three nine. Zero eight. Zero eight. Um, six five one five. Six one. Six one. No six five. Six one. One five. Six five one five. Yes. So zero zero. The account. Zero zero. So the account with it. <laughs> My boss <laughs> zero zero three nine <laughs> zero eight six five one five. Timmy, Timmy, right? Uh, think, last think last think last yes, think 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 yeah. think like it's me. Okay. Yes, yes, that's it. Okay. I just deleted the account with two hundred and fifty thousand uh, now. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank I just deleted the account with two hundred and fifty thousand. The two hundred and fifty k is. Even if you reject the offer of what I'm going to give you, even if we discuss the business, we will talk in the other room. I will tell you what I want to do for you, okay? And uh, what okay, you can, boss. what you can do for me. If you reject it, yes, boss. The money is yours. If you accept it, we'll continue. It's a way of telling you, I want to work with you. In the long run, I want us to do things together, yes, okay? Boss. I have a lot of packages that I can put. I can decide to go and I tell you, okay, take it, let's do it. We are going to be uh, uh, CMC. What we can we'll talk about? We can talk about so many things. You understand? So that just proves that that's what he wanted. You see how Timmy came live. According to all the story we've heard so far, yeah. you see how Timmy came live and he gave um, Chuki actually Chuki T because I, I call him Timmy. Anyways, uh, oh, ew. Chukiti, but you see how Chukiti came live and he gave Chukiti 250,000 at first and he said whether you agree to the contract or not, I will give you this, right? And then if you not agree, we can now work together. I guess that was what he wanted to do with Erica. It's just that he did not come and tell the whole world, well, you know what? I want to give her two million naira, but this is the condition. Jonathan, I'm sure he wanted Erica to come live first so that they can sort the issue out. All I would just say is, even for Chukiti himself, yeah, because that's how people get to sign very, very funny contracts. I don't know what, for him to even come live, that means there must have been a contract under the table. Not on the table, behind the scenes, get me? I just say that everybody should just be wary. Be careful, you know, as to what you're signing, do you understand? 
but I'm happy for Tricky. I hope much more come, much more comes his way. Amen. I'm very happy for him. But what's your opinion with this whole matter? Erica hasn't said a word. It's just the I, I don't even know who the guy is, but it was that guy that came and spoke and everything just casted. But what's your opinion? Do you think do you think the CMT guy is wrong? Do you think that 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 particular guy is wrong? Do you think Erica's team is wrong? I believe that Erica's team needs to just say something, anything, address it, because I mean it's Erica's name that is being tossed about up and down because erica's name i just feel like it's too early for you to be in a war with brand and brand deal and contract and oh it's too early oh so i also think that erica's team needs to learn to communicate things you understand everything wasn't be said online but i mean say some things online too because if you say online how will i hear the jisha but i want to know your opinion are you happy for i'm happy for tricky are you happy for him do you think you need to be careful what do you think about the cmc guy is he a fluke is he a fraud but i mean because he's saying that even if he wants to give a 500k 500k like it's not beans is it 10k they pick it from the floor do you get me I want to hear your opinion in the comment section, my darling. But that is the messiness going on right now about Erica and CMC and contract and money and car and all that. And did you hear the part, the part where they said that the car is already being shipped? Did you hear that part? It's actually already coming. But what's your opinion? So talk to me in the comment section. I want to hear your opinion, my darling. One more thing. Don't forget, oh honey, if your goal is to make money online, like you want to start a business here and start to make money, start to make more sales, you want the world to know about you, but you don't know how to go about it. Social media marketing is confusing to you. I want to help you out. So I'm partnering with Stephanie Ibrahim, a startup coach, and I'm a brand strategist. We are going to be teaching you everything you need to know about how to grow your business online. Online. You'll be taking courses on branding, social media communication, graphic design, sales and marketing, business planning, financial planning, and entrepreneurial mindset. It is an online bootcamp here, so you can be anywhere in the world and attend this. It begins from the 17th of October to the 1st of November 2020. It is only 10,000 naira. Guys, it's a three weeks intensive training. What that means is I'll be giving you assignments, and it happens only Saturdays and Sundays, only weekends. You get we have Monday to Friday to do the assignments the idea is to get that idea from your head eh? out of your head into life so i'll be giving you assignments do a video for me open this page it is a very practical bootcamp it's so practical after three weeks eh? <laughs> don't worry you will see that you you will just see the testimony you will tell me after the three weeks but i hope you you know sign up for it to register please go to kickstart.busyideas.com i'll put the link in the description below let's go and click it and register we have like what maybe like 22 more days to go don't all get me but that's all for today my darling thank you for watching i love you Bye -bye.